Merry Christmas, everyone. Happy holidays. I hope you all are having a great time on Christmas Day with your family and friends. And if you are not, I hope this video brings you some joy or whatever it is you may be looking for right now in this holiday season. I know it can be difficult for a lot of people to be around their family <laughs> during this time. So I'm here for you and I hope that it gets better for you. So we are going to be doing the what I got for Christmas video that everyone always does on Christmas day. So this video is actually gonna be a lot different compared to what uh, most people's what I got for Christmas is, is because usually I just get money. <laughs> because that's what I want that's what I like and I just want the Christmas money and that's it okay and I'll just get the things myself even though half the time once I get the money I feel like I have to put it in my savings account so that I don't end up buying anything for myself and I just stock up my savings account because I feel like that's what I need to do because I'm cheap and I'm also scared of anything possibly happening and me needing the money and why do I need all these things when I could just put it in the savings account for a rainy day and if I need something then I might as well just put it in the savings account instead of buying this random crap that I probably won't want and a year or two but <laughs> with that being said <laughs> we do have some things on the list of what i most likely will be getting since i just moved and i'm in a new room and i need to decorate it so some of the things i'm showing you i might actually get i might not just put all my money in the savings account what new concept so the one and only physical thing that I have that was a gift is from Hannah. She was in all the Vlogmas stuff. She got me a new mocha. It's so nice. I love it so much. In the beginning of the year, I had like a smaller version of this that I got from TJ Maxx and the handle broke off. So I wasn't able to use a mocha pretty much since like May. And so she got me a new one, which I appreciated a lot. If you are trying to learn how to make like lattes and stuff, but you don't want to spend money on getting a um, espresso machine, you can get espresso grounds and use a mocha like this you can start learning how to make lattes in a more affordable way that's why i really enjoy this um it does take a while if you want to do it right because you have to put it on the stove and on like kind of a lower setting but i usually just do like other things while that's happening so it's really i really enjoy the mocha so yeah, but now we will get into the things that I plan on buying with my Christmas money. So let's get into it. First and foremost, we will do the things that I want from Etsy. So from Etsy, I have a lot of bookish prints that I want to get so I can like put it all over my walls and stuff. So I'll put most of them on the screen here. I have some from The Love Hypothesis, um, It Ends With Us, some more The Love Hypothesis, uh, Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo, and then I also have a sweatshirt that I might want to get that's also um, uh, Evelyn Hugo merch and i also have a sweatshirt merch for the love hypothesis as well and then those are the bookish related like prints and decor things that i want from etsy and then after that i also want some more prints because i have nothing on the walls guys okay bear with me <laughs> i want a poster of the band camino because i love the band camino and then i also want a poster for five sauce their fifth album if you've been watching the vlogs then you know that i've been listening to the their five sauce five album like non-stop and so it's only fitting that i just go ahead and get a poster for it you know um so i will probably get that from etsy um i haven't really looked into like their regular websites for themselves to see if i want to get it from them specifically or not so we'll see about that but I also found this gallery wall set um, that has six prints on it. It's instant download, so you just print it yourself. Those are the main things from Etsy. So then we will move on to Amazon. So since I just moved into this room, there are a few like furniture things I still need. Not Well, they're more like not necessarily needs they're just wants at this point but i would like another bookcase because if i buy like one more book 
it ain't gonna fit. <laughs> so I think instead of getting another Target basic white one, like the one I have, I really want this like um, bookshelf ladder type of thing that <laughs> is going on and since I have a lot of uh furniture that's white because I got it from like Ikea or Target or whatever I want to like switch it up a little bit I want this one perfume I'll have it I'll have the screenshots on the screen I don't want to try to pronounce it but um someone on TikTok <laughs> was recommending some um Arab perfumes because they last a lot longer and um this was one of them that i was like the most interested in getting so i plan on getting that and then i need to stock up on some vitamin c serums so um i really do like the natrum brand um and so i would probably get some of that and then i actually bought this for myself already so i'm just waiting for it to come in the mail and it is this silk button down long sleeve shirt i have this same one in green and i just love the feel of it i love the look of it and so i wanted to get one in black and i probably will end up getting one in white at some point as well and i got it in an extra large i'll show you the green one actually so this is the green one um i wasn't expecting her to be this bright of a green i thought she would be a little darker but she's warm up to me and i've worn it once but that one time i wore it i was really into it <laughs> so i really do enjoy it um i like the feel of it the look of it and it's just a nice time i do need to steam it because um it was in my space saving bags for like a week so it's kind of wrinkly but it is what it is um <laughs> so i just ordered that in black and at some point i'll just end up getting all the colors probably but yeah <laughs> and then back to some furniture i do need a full length mirror so um i did save this gold one on amazon as well and then i do want a chair that is that i can put by the window so i can have like a cute little like reading nook area so that's on the list don't know how soon i'll get the furniture stuff like i'm probably gonna pace myself with those um but yeah and so then lastly i am bookish nisha so it would only be fitting to talk about some of the books i want to buy <laughs> so for one i want to get Babel. I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. I truly don't really know what it's about, but I do know it's kind of like a heavier topic because it literally says Babel or the necessity of violence an arcane, an arcane history of the o Oxford translators revolution. So <laughs> it's probably going to be a little heavy. The author for this book is also, also the same author for the Poppy War trilogy, which I still have yet to read, but I don't know she just seems like she she knows what she's doing when it comes to writing so i want to check her out i do want pride and prejudice the children classic edition i find this these um publishers editions of the classics so beautiful and so pretty I do have their edition of Weathering Heights um, and it's just so pretty and so I really do want the Pride and Prejudice one as well. I want like pretty much everything they have. And so then I also want Blood Marked, the second book in the Legendborn series. I have the first one. I haven't read it yet. <laughs> um, and I want the second one. It makes sense, doesn't it? Those are just a couple books that I do plan on buying, um, especially since I have Kindle Unlimited now. I'm like decreasing the amount of books I physically buy, but those are just a few that I'm like, you know what? I don't care. I still want it. <laughs> so yeah but that's pretty much it for this video guys um i hope you guys don't feel like i'm bragging too much or anything especially since this is stuff that i technically have to buy myself still um <laughs> i'm not bragging i'm just telling you my thought process on what the heck it is i want to use my money on so who knows i probably won't even buy half of these things and i'll just end up putting everything in the savings account like i usually do we'll see i hope you guys have a very merry christmas um i also hope you guys enjoyed the vlogmas videos i successfully did post for 25 days which was surprising for me considering i was graduating and moving states <laughs> but i mean i am a newbie at this so i wasn't 
doing too much with <laughs> vlogmas or anything i know a lot of other uh vloggers put a lot of time and effort into their videos for they put a lot of time and effort for their videos and for vlogmas they like take it super seriously and since i'm more of a smaller channel i was like it doesn't really make sense for me to like have a whole mental breakdown over vlogmas <laughs> so yeah that's probably one of the main reasons i was able to do it on my first try but yeah i do hope you guys enjoyed the vlogs i did enjoy doing it so maybe next year i'll do it again who knows um but yeah um i hope you guys have a lovely day thank you guys so much for watching like and subscribe and i will see you next time bye